the 2019 Chevrolet Corvette ZR1 has finally landed, and in Dubai of all places. We'll get to the reasons behind the Dubai debut later. Right now you're probably craving specs, so have at it. Due in showrooms next spring, the 2019 Corvette ZR1 is the fastest and most powerful Corvette in the nameplate's history. At its heart is a new V8 code named the LT5. Corvette fans will recognize the engine code from the V8 used in the C4 Corvette ZR1 of the early 90s. The modern LT5 is a 6.2-liter supercharged V8 delivering 755 horsepower and 715 pound-feet of torque. The engine is based on the design of the LT4 V8 fitted to the Corvette Z06 and a couple of other cars, but it benefits from a more efficient intercooled supercharger with 52 percent more displacement than the LT4 supercharger. The engine also features General Motors' first dual-fuel injection system, which employs primary direct injection and supplemental port injection. All of the power is routed to the rear wheels, either via 7-speed manual or an 8-speed automatic. This is the first time an automatic is being offered in a ZR1, with so much power going through only the rear wheels. Chevrolet knew the ZR1 was going to need some serious downforce to make full use of all of that. Oomph! The engineers actually came up with two packages, with a more extreme option. Dubbed the high wing, for obvious reasons, capable of generating up to 950 pounds of downforce. It's part of the ZTK performance package, which also includes a front splitter with carbon fiber and caps. Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 Summer Only Tires and specific calibration for the chassis and magnetic ride suspension. The other option is the low wing, which will see the car reach its highest top speed, in this case over 210 miles per hour, but offer lower downforce than the high wing option. There's still 70% more downforce than a Z06, though. Chevy says the wings are incorporated into the car's structure. Just like on the Corvette C7, our race car, for added strength and stability. And they work with the aero at the front, which includes a downforce enhancing front underwing. Also at the front is a new fascia designed to feed plenty of cool air to the car's 13 heat. Exchangers it's clear Chevy has learned its lessons from the Z06's overheating issues. A final tidbit Chevy has revealed is availability of a Sebring orange design package. In addition to a bright orange exterior color, the package also includes orange brake calipers, orange rocker and splitter accent stripes, orange seat belts, orange interior stitching and unique bronze aluminum interior trim. Also for the interior, there's full leather trim, a carbon fiber steering wheel, sport seats, a performance data recorder, and a Bose sound system. The new ZR1 was previewed on Sunday. It will now make its official world debut on Tuesday at the 2017 Dubai Motor Show. A North American appearance will follow later in the month at the 2017 Los Angeles Auto Show where we'll likely learn much more about this exciting road rocket. So why is the greatest Corvette of making its debut in Dubai? The car was originally due earlier this year, as a 2018 model. But plant upgrades at the Corvette's Bowling Green, Kentucky. Home meant the 2018 model year for the Corvette was cut short. And with order books for the 2019 Corvette range, including the ZR1, opening on November 20, Chevy needed to reveal the car ASAP. Although the LA Auto Show seems the more natural option for the debut, it doesn't open its doors until November 29.